Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to react to the Sydney Swans vs Richmond Tigers. The final scores was Richmond 93 to the Sydney Swans 67. I actually thought that we played okay, but Richmond just got some easy quick goals which really bothered me. Parker Kennedy Lloyd did a wonderful job. Kennedy with the 40 possessions, 36 whatever, he played stunning today. He was a rocket. Lloyd, of course, in there as well. Every week he's got over 30 possessions along with Josh Kennedy. Parker got injured a couple of times, so fair enough he didn't get that many possessions. But we only scored one behind for the whole game. That's unusual, but doesn't really matter at the end of the day. They dominated the kicks 221 to 176. We dominated the handballs, which I wasn't happy about. The handballs was a race, some of them. 153 to 160, I wasn't happy at all. Disposals, 374 to 336, yeah, fair enough, they won the game, they can win that. Disposal effectively doesn't really matter, they won 75% to 70%. I just have to say this, Ronk is a star. He's like better than Tom Papley, better than old star Ben McGlynn. He's going into an absolute champion. When he grows up one day, he's going to be really good. Same with McCartan, but he might have to go out the team soon to replace Reed. And I'm not sure if Malikin's going to come back in the team because we have a good team right now. But anyway, inside 50s were 62 to 42, 43, sorry. They won that, but we got to work on our inside 50s. Contested possessions, 143 to 152. We normally always win the contested possessions. Uncontested possessions, 241 to 189. We got smashed in that. Marks, 196.6. That's also something we got smashed by. Contested marks, 15 to 11. Marks inside, 50, 17 to 6. Tackles, 69 to 84. Tackles inside, forward, 50, 12 to 8. Intercept possessions, 85 to 71. Didn't win that. Turnovers, 71 to 85. Clearances, 31 to 39. We're pretty good at clearances. Stoppage clearances, 17 to 28. Hitouts, 45 to 40. Pretty close. Bounces are all even, 8 to 8. Freeze, 4, 19 to 25. So overall, that was pretty good. We did lose a lot of stats, but we won heaps of stats, even though we lost the I game. know we only scored one behind, but at the first quarter, the scores were six goals, one to three goals, one, then seven goals, two to five goals, one, then 11 goals, five to 10 goals, one, then 14 goals, nine to 11 goals, one. We were right in the game at the half frame mark of the last quarter until they kicked heaps of easy goals, which really frustrates me and ended up winning. But now, I'm going to show you guys some Swan's cool highlight goals that I really like to watch. So let's see them. Parker took that extra step, but it's okay. Franklin in a good spot. What a duel. Ransom Franklin rocks onto it. You talked about Friday night. Welcome to Thursday night, young fella. Long one of only three players this year to kick seven. Oh. Buddy and Lynch both have kicked eight this year. Chance here for Floston just to... Pick it off, couldn't quite, Rose, first game of the year, Rock again. You can't script this stuff. First two. That's a clever kick to a very, very good target. Who's in a good spot, I reckon, for him. Could he nail this one from the pocket? Got one in the first. Improves the angle. It's a beautiful kick. It's just... Is it? It is. It is. It's a good kick, actually. If they can make it, Rose just probably didn't go quite hard enough from Richley. He went hard enough there. Hayward had a fumble. Ellis, Rose, well done. Florent breaks the tackle, gets the 48, goes for goal, kicks it. That's a beauty. What a kick. Quiet night, Caddy. Flicks it back to Rance. Rance, oh, he's gone. He should be gone. He is. Florent got him. 50 metre penalties pay. It's holding the ball. Ollie, Ollie, the football's over there. It's and a 50. 50. Yeah, 50. It's Alex, it's calm down, please. Because a player of yours, Dylan Grimes, charged in and buried the ball. That's why. No. So, so you ask the question, Ray gives you the answer. So. No, no. Let's see what Dylan does do. It's fine. I play holding the ball, yeah. Well, and then Dylan's charged in and buried the ball. 
And the goal is kicked by Florin, who gets his second, and the Swans get within seven. Hard pressed up against the boundary line, gave it to Floss, and he got pinched. And the Swans rebound here. Remember, they trailed by 20. It's just, look, it's, it's just terribly reckless because you could do so much damage to a boy there. You've got to be so careful. You're having the night of your life. Yeah, that's unnecessary, and you might miss. Well, you could yeah, knock a boy's tough footballer. He's the man for the moment. Back we go to third. Out too. Yep. Good contest, though, by that little fellow that we talk about. Rock, he is a fascinating player. Now, can Rose do something here? Get to a good spot. Ellis, cut away. Swans have got it. Parker kicks his second. <laughs> He's a very good player. They got those two. So, Parker, big third quarter. Lovely kick to Hayward. It was perfectly... Massive kick in the context of the match. It's a good one. Good finish. He and Parker have been able to keep the minute. Last 30 minutes of Thursday night footy, 1v2, and the Swans have got a bit of a roll on. Kennedy, 31 touches in the opening three quarters, and right on cue, the skipper goes. Thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.